Hey, what's up, home slices? <laughs> How y'all doing tonight? That's great. I'm so glad to hear it. I'm gonna move this out of the way. Yeah, I'm feeling kind of depressed right now. No. Yeah. <laughs> Last night I broke up with my significant other, and it was such a messy breakup that today I'm still feeling a lot of pain, mostly from all that shoveling. <laughs> yeah, bitches be tripping. <laughs> Am I right? Amen. How am I doing on time? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm still working that fix. <laughs> Ouch. <laughs> Everyone always says living well is the best revenge, but I'm going to stick with flaming bags of human feces left on the doorstep. Yeah. <laughs> I hate to kick a man when he's down, but I've got to admit, it does make it a hell of a lot easier. <laughs> <laughs> Hashtag too blessed to be stressed. <laughs> <laughs> Who's with me? Yeah. Who is Almost everyone. Wow. <laughs> awesome. This is going awesome. So. Let's give it up for everyone here tonight. <laughs> Whose last name begins with the letters A through L only. Unfortunately, <laughs> <laughs> that sucks all the time permits right now. <laughs> this is really kind of annoying me by holding this. I'm, I'm going to set this down. I'm not even sure why I brought that up here with me. It doesn't even belong to me. <laughs> Hearing my alarm clock go off this morning was a real wake-up call for me. <laughs> I'm so totally wasted at my current job, but it's the only way I can handle driving a school bus for handicapped children six hours a day. <laughs> I just got back from L.A. where I was meeting with some of the movers and shakers in the entertainment industry. I was pitching my idea for a TV sitcom about a double amputee, but everyone kept telling me it didn't have legs. Hi, <laughs> all <laughs> That's a bummer. That's a bummer, but like I said after I hit that lactating pregnant woman with my car, <laughs> No use crying over spilled milk. <laughs> exactly what I said. Yeah, I just, I just joined a new health club that promised me that I could have the body of a 20-year-old. Finally, I can get some use out of that new double-wide stand-up freezer I bought at Costco. <laughs> What I love most about entertaining at children's birthday parties <laughs> is the look of surprise on their faces when they first figure out I'm not really a cop. <laughs> <laughs> Kids be tripping. <laughs> Am I right? Yep. Take it from me, I learned the hard way that construction workers in real life are far less open to suggestion than they are in gay porn. <laughs> <laughs> Today, I made a resolution to start running at least five miles every day and keep it up until the police no longer have any idea where I am. <laughs> Click like if you agree. <laughs> I was coming out of the grocery store and I saw that someone had left a baby locked inside a hot car. <laughs> and that made me very angry because I suddenly remembered that I'd forgotten to buy barbecue sauce. <laughs> <laughs> too real. Too real, 
Thank you. Huzzah. Thank you. Happy Christmas now. I give everyone on my gift list amputated legs. They make such great stocking stuffers. <laughs> Well, it's true that being comfortable in your own skin is considered a sign of mental health. Being comfortable in anyone else's skin isn't. <laughs> Everyone says curiosity killed the cat. At least that's what I said to my next door neighbor when she started asking too many questions. <laughs> When my grandfather was laid out of his funeral, everyone kept commenting on how natural he looked. But by then it was too late to put clothes on him. <laughs> yeah, no lie. No lie, yeah. The town I grew up in was very old-fashioned, which sounds so much nicer than whites only. <laughs> Agree. Yeah, but I had a pretty good time growing up there, though. I remember I had a dog that I loved a lot until its owner discovered the two of us alone together. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. Too real. Damn. Too real. Give it too soon. Yeah, thank you. Yeah, when I was a child, I had kind of a trashy reputation. I had a sticker on my bike that said my other ride is a youth minister. <laughs> oh, wow. Okay, I gotta wrap this up before I get shot by one of those dogs. I was in a bar and I met him and it told me he had an 11 inch penis, but I found that hard to swallow. <laughs> It's only fun until someone stops getting hurt. Thank you. <laughs> Come on, keep going for David Franks. Come on. Oh, you hear a laugh harder while being so uncomfortable in your life. Also, uh, David, you look very happy.